Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. My last couple videos, you haven't really heard me at all. So lucky you, you get to listen to me today. So we are going to be doing a outfit inspired makeup look. My outfit isn't really anything crazy, but I have another video planned that has to do with being artsy. So I've got this cute t-shirt that has art on it and it shows two tigers and some flowers and I think it's super cute. And then I just have a black skater skirt on underneath. I uh, don't plan on leaving the house today, so I don't have any shoes or anything else. My outfit's pretty basic, but I thought the shirt's really cute and it's red so I can play with some color because usually I don't use crazy colors in my normal day-to-day -day makeup, which is usually just eyeliner and mascara. Anyway. So today I'm going to be using my BH Cosmetics Take Me Back to Brazil palette because they've got a red color in it that is like exactly the same color or at least close enough. And then for Christmas, my mommy got me the Jaclyn Hill palette. Um, I'm going to be honest with you, I don't know who Jaclyn Hill is. I've only ever heard of her palette which is kind of funny and I'm sure people are going to be disappointed in me, but I'm sorry, I don't know. I don't know her, but her palette is really pretty and I might use some of these colors for, you know, transition shades and all that stuff. Not that I really know how to do makeup well. I just watch other YouTubers and copy what they do. So that's what we're going to be doing today. I'm thinking maybe some of the tiger stripes, maybe do a flower. I'm not really sure because of course like eyes, not a lot of space to work with, but we're gonna try our best. So first we're going to start off with my Wet n Wild foundation. I talked about this a couple times because this is the only foundation that I own. So that's what we're gonna go in with today. I've got my beauty blender and I wet it already. It looks gross because I've tried to use it without wetting it because I didn't know you had to wet it. I'm also gonna be going in with my concealer and putting some foundation there because I feel like this is really light for me, but maybe I'm just dramatic and I'm not used to not seeing dark bags on my Okay, so there's my foundation and concealer done. My nose looks a little bit red, but that's just because I did a pore strip before this video. So, you know, just ripped all the blackheads out my nose. My nose is a little upset about it. So we are going to move on. I'm going to prep my eyes with the MAC Laying Low Pro Longwear Pink Pop. to go into the Jaclyn Hill palette. Um, usually people use like a shade like that for a transition shade, so we're just gonna copy those people and go in with that shade. <laughs>
cute Brazil palette. It's like, it's a pretty cute red. Whole bunch of red all over my face. Good thing to my foundation first. So then we're gonna go back into the Jaclyn Hill palette and see if we can darken up that crease a little bit. Mm, I don't know. Maybe like this color? That's great. adventure together and as you can obviously tell my makeup skills are amazing so this is gonna go great can't wait Next, 
eyeliner. I've got the NYX Professional Makeup Epic Ink Liner. It's the brush tip one. I love it. As you can probably see, yep, there's a little hair sticking out because when you, you can like put it in wrong and then it's a mess. <laughs> Next, I'm going to be putting in my Ardell Wispies. I usually put on the Demi Wispies, but I destroyed those, so we're going to go with the Wispies. pretty good so we're just gonna not um highlighter I've got the wet and wild mega glow highlighting mega glow highlighting powder okay now I have to pick lit got like I'm not sure if I have any good colors. But um, let's try this nude gloss because my lips are dry, so we don't want to do liquid lipstick. Well, it looks kind of weird in person, but on camera, it looks okay. So, yeah. Let me, let's see, I feel like I'm missing stuff. I can do my bottom lashes, then it was fast. Okay, and I think that's the completed look. Didn't do anything too crazy. Was thinking of doing like tiger stripes or like flower or something. But I'm filming another video after this and it'll be really confusing. Like in that video, if you see me with like craziness on my eyes, might be distracting. I don't know. 
and also like I think it looks cute like this. I don't usually do like fun colors on my eyelids and I think it just looks really cute. Um, I also don't do lashes too often. I've been getting into them more. I'm not very good at applying them as you probably saw, but I did try my best. So yeah, so let me know if you like this, if you care enough to tell me. Um, but yeah. So I will see you guys, or you will see me, because I don't, I can't see through this. But you're gonna see me in my next video. I hope you liked this one, you enjoyed it, or if you didn't, I'm sorry, but not really, because I enjoy making these videos. So see you guys later. Goodbye. Thank you.